Right, let's continue with the second last part of this chapter to change a chart type. Why do you want to change? Okay, maybe you want to have a different view of the chart. Okay, so right now we are using clustered chart and then afterwards we want to change it to 3D clustered bar chart. Okay, so now what you have to do is display the chart tools design tab, chart tools design tab. Okay, design and then click the change type button okay change type button click 3d clustered bar chart eh? still bar chart 3d clustered okay and then just click ok and this is what you will get a 3d clustered bar next is just click the OK button to change the chart. Alright, so I've uh, clicked the, uh, the OK button just now. Save the revised memo on your hard drive to okay, now is with table and cluster chart. Save it as okay. Fitness Center Revenue Comparison Memo with Table and 3D Clustered Chart and 3D Clustered Chart Okay, click Save And the last one is to view and scroll through documents side by side Now what you have to do is you have to position the cursor uh, at the top of the document okay top of document because you want to begin viewing side by side from the top of the documents open the file called fitness center revenue comparison memo with table and cluster chart okay, the one that you have just did right, work where is it okay here Okay, and then okay, we have two files open here. Next is display the view tab. View tab. Okay, click view side by side button. Okay, view side by side button. Okay, to display each open window side by side. See? This is nice eh, for you to, to double check what have you changed eh, other than you are using the, let's say, track changes. But then track changes is better for changes, eh, for editing purposes. But here, you just want to see roughly what's what's the, the difference or maybe you want to compare. Not not compare, you want to, to, to have two files. Eh? Usually, we do it manually. We open and we resize the window and so on resize and resize the other one but here okay, we do it faster okay, using a view view side by side okay and then scroll to the bottom of the window and notice how both windows scroll together all right okay so it scrolls together so everything seems the same except for for the uh, chart yeah, this one is clustered bar chart. This one is 3D clustered. Alright, next, if necessary, display the view tab once again. And then click the synchronous scrolling button. Can't you see the synchronous uh, scrolling button at the Windows group here? Wait, why it doesn't move? Okay. Okay, so this is the... Okay, right now it is synchronous. So if, eh, let's say you scroll up and down for this left document, okay, it will not scroll the other side. Eh? So you turn, turn off the uh, asynchronous, uh, the, the synchronous uh, but, uh, button just now. Eh? You turn off the synchronous button. Okay, and if you want to have it, Synchronous, okay, just right. 
okay uh, here synchronous okay why it doesn't happen okay this one Right, synchronous. Okay. All right. And then in either windows, click the view side by side to turn off the. Okay, done. Close each open window document, serving them if prompted. Okay, so just close this file, these two files. Okay, and we have completed the chapter. Okay. Thank you.